I don't know, it looks like fish, isn't it? So yeah, finally, we're yeah, finally yeah. here. Well, finally in the Billingham, well, just a Billingham booth, but it's not exactly the Billingham factory. Which is nearby, actually. It's about half an hour drive from here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But yeah, that will be like the, the Charlie's Chocolate Factory. <laughs> uh, Winning the golden ticket, exactly. Small people coming out <laughs> singing something like that. Lumpa Lumpa. Lumpa Lumpa Lumpa. Something like that. Lumpa Lumpa. So yeah. we've got our own bags as well. Which one do you have, Locke? Oh, of course, I've got the Hadley Pro. And I also have a Hadley Pro, but the younger version. But they have some new bags out. Uh, which is, I think, announced not too long ago. They've had the new one, which is the uh, Hadley One. Oh. Doom. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, th this is nice because because I, I played one of the Hadley Pro Large as well, and you know, it's, it's quite big. I, mean, I think it's for certain case use. But this one is like, in terms of size, it's right in between the Hadley Pro and the Hadley Pro Large. That's the Hadley Pro. Pro. The Hadley One. One. And then the Hadley Large. Hadley Two. Pro. Oh, <laughs> yeah, the Hadley Large Pro. But yeah, so it's like, it's right in between. But also like the improvement on this is that uh, it got this detachable strap. Yeah. Oh, they changed the insert a little bit as well. Yeah, they made, they made the back padding a bit more like uh, pronounced because when people were using the Hadley Pro, they saw people using MacBooks or laptops at the back. Yeah. And the back wasn't as well padded, but this one, they made it specifically padded for the MacBook or for your laptop or any laptop. That exactly when I put my MacBook Pro 32 inch into my bag, I specifically put the back of the MacBook Pro against me because the back should be um, stronger. But yeah. now they improve it. Nice bit of padding, yeah. It's like a lot of time I don't actually put my camera in there. I put my, my own stuff. Yeah, I yes. don't always need all the padding around the whole bag. Mm. So now the, this new one, you can have just this inside bit as padded, yeah. outside bit without. So it's more space. I mean, it got more space because on mine, it's just all or nothing. Yeah. Padding or no padding at all. But here, where I can have a choice. Yeah. I can have more padding or only one for my camera and then other space for other things. Essentially, it's still a Hadley uh, with some kind of, you could say improvements or bits and bobs here and there. But they've also added this uh, kind of rain thing at the back. So they've made a waterproof zipper. And I mean, there's no, there's, yeah, 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 yeah. there's been no complaints about rain seeping into the original Hadleys. But this one, they made it specifically waterproof zipper as well. And oh no, it's flip. Uh, oh, oh, I lost my voice. It goes into luggage, this yeah. bit. Yeah. Oh my I thought God. That's, actually, that's pretty handy. Yeah. Actually, that's really good. It's I've like, been wondering. wow, it's already, this one's already really great. I love it a lot. <laughs> and then they improve that as well. Shit. So he's going to go buy a few now. Oh, yeah, it is. Thank you. Big problem. Big problem for my wallet. Card, yeah, your wallet's gonna go straight to Billingham. So obviously Billingham have been making a lot of bags since, well, a long time ago. And uh, they've got a selection of different uses of the bags as well. They've got, one is the overnighter, which is actually pretty cool. It's like an overnight bag for your overnight stay somewhere. Quite handy actually. Got on like a nice, kind of nice mesh in the middle. But uh, I think it's just, uh, it's kind of like the one in between, like if you don't want something as big as the Weekender, which is there. That man is the Weekender. If you don't want something as big as that, this is quite handy as well. And then obviously they've got this, actually this is more for like, uh, so this is called the Thomas Brief, I believe. And obviously it's got brief in its name because it's kind of like a briefcase. So every day you go into the office and you don't really need let's just say a camera bag, but you want something for your laptop and something that looks nice as well. So this is their Thomas Brief one. And uh, proper English, they've also put an umbrella hook there because 
Everyone knows how sunny it is, of course, in the UK. Um, so a really good selection of bags from Billingham uh, that's come out this year, and we'll see what comes out next year as well. It's very old, and it's coming all around the world. So yeah, it's probably about 28 or 30 years old. Yeah, that sounds about right. I can't, I can't wait for the day that I can show off my bag to, hey kids, this is my bag. I've used it for 30 years. 